What's up guys? Just going to do a video real quick about how to fix the no SIM error on an iPhone. This is a 6S. Um, I bought it on eBay and when it arrived, um, I was trying to activate it and it kept saying no SIM. And so as you may know, you cannot activate a phone at all without a uh, SIM card being recognized. So I was pretty much screwed. So, um, Basically, I just tried everything. I went onto every like blog I could find. I I tried everything, trying to get this phone to work, and couldn't do it. So I figured what I might as well do is just go for broke and start basically breaking things and try to get it to work. And what I ended up doing was bending the SIM card slot, not the reader, of course, but just the like the slot where the SIM card goes, and that worked. So let me uh, show you how to do that. All right, so here we have the iPhone. Uh, and I actually already bent this one, um, and you can see when you pop it out, no SIM installed, of course. So here you can see SIM card, and you can see that it's just a little bit kind of bent there. Uh, and I actually have another reader here, so I'm going to show you that this doesn't actually work with um, a regular reader. So this one here you can see is not bent. This is just a straight out of the phone one. So you can see no SIM. And then when I put this one in, and this was actually just a reader I got off of um, China or off of eBay for almost nothing, uh, no fix. Still says no SIM, even if I do the trick where you try and turn off the airplane mode and then back on, that sometimes will fix it, says some of these blogs that are lying. No SIM. However, I have good news. Uh, so when I go and take this one out, switch it over to the other one. All right, so here you can see the other reader that I have that was already in there is bent just slightly in the center. I'm gonna pop in the SIM card here. And then take the phone, which is on no SIM, of course. And then we're just gonna pop it into the slot there. And you are going to have to push it quite a bit because it is bent slightly. So it's really going to be forcing down against those contacts. And then immediately we switch to no service, which means you can activate your phone. Uh, and I'm out of the country, which is why that says no service. I don't have a, a, an activated SIM card, but I guess I do. Look at that. Cool. So as you can see, it works. So maybe this will solve the problem for you. And so in order to bend the reader, it's really easy to do by hand. This is the straight one, the extra that I have. I'll just go ahead and show you. This is the top of the reader. So the part that will face the top of the phone. You're just going to go ahead and grab it and give it a bit of a push down. And so you can see right there it is bent uh, and then you will just install it like usual. All right, so that will pretty much wrap it up for the video. Uh, if you've gone through the blogs and tried their different steps of resetting your phone, doing a software update and those didn't work, hopefully the problem was indeed with the contacts not lining up with your SIM reader and your SIM card. If that's the case, this honestly should work for you. If not, uh, the other option you might have is you can get it professionally done or you can try it yourself but you will have to open your phone is replacing the sim reader uh, the only problem with that is once again it's kind of a liability or you're, you're gonna you know toss your warranty and you're also gonna have to open your phone which is always a risk um, and if that doesn't work i don't know what to tell you good luck uh, if this video is helpful for you please feel free to subscribe and you can leave me a comment below thanks guys